President Trump hosted a tense meeting with vaping industry executives and public health advocates at the White House this week. The president is reportedly considering backing off from his original decision to ban flavored e-cigarettes. In fact, the New York Times reports his allies in the vaping industry have warned about potential pushback from voters in the president's base. Conservative activists are concerned that Trump could risk losing votes in swing states by cracking down on flavored products. The president seemed eager to follow through with the ban just two months ago. Listen to those remarks compared to what he said on Friday. We can't allow people to get sick and we can't have our youth be so affected. People are dying with vaping. So we're looking at it very closely. You watch prohibition, you look at, you know, with the alcohol, you look at cigarettes illegal. If you don't give it to them, it's going to come here illegally. Yes, okay, right. they're going to make it. But instead of rentals or jewel or, you know, legitimate companies, good companies making something that's safe, they're going to be selling stuff on the street corner that could be horrible. And U.S. health officials say there have been 47 vaping-related deaths here in the U.S. so far. When we return... The and they never mentioned the CDC linked... The vapor on the system, vitamin E, acetate oil, and it's on their own website.